Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome to my uh, video, Hondo Gaming, Episode 1. Got a dynasty going with TCU. Go Frogs, baby. First game of the season, we're playing SMU, like always. I'm tired of these guys, but you know what? We scheduled them. Let's get the iron skillet. It's the last time we played them. They torched us. Shane Bichel had a day. So we got Tommy Lynch here, first game at TCU. Gary Patterson went pro, retired, but whatever. It's Tommy Lynch's time to start a new wave. Gary Patterson will always be a legend. He got a statue outside the stadium, so he'll always be loved here. Easy run for Barlow, five yards. Our backfield's pretty lethal. We got a young squad on this team, so if you're a big fan, for TCU like myself, I know you got your shades on for the future here is bright. And at a quarterback, you know what we got, Mad Max Duggan. Dude is a truth, man. He can run, he can pass, he can do it all. But don't forget Zach Evans, another true freshman, easy seven yard rush. After losing Jalen Reger, who do we got? Quentin Johnson, wearing the same number and also a true freshman. So the editing might be a little choppy. My first ever video, so you know, give me some time. I had some fun doing it, but lucky. It was a kind of pain at the same time. I guess people who do this will understand. But yeah. So Mad Max for an easy nine yards. So far we're driving on these guys. I think if we keep this up, it might be an easy game. I mean, it depends on our defense. But I think our defense will be solid. If their defense is tired of Max running already, they could they contain him. Mm -mm -mm. Nowhere to go, so he throw it out of bounds. Yep, yep, yep. So second and ten. We were so close to scoring, I could smell the end zone. Mad Max rolls out left. One man to beat. But he just stood up at the two-yard line. That's a good tackle. If you can tackle... If you could tackle Max Duggan and open the field, man, I'm going to give you like a high five or something because that's not easy to do. But Barlow takes it in for a two-yard rush. Touchdown, Frogs. 7-0. Well, about to be 7-0. <clears throat> so, their first possession. Let's get a stop. Main goal, obviously. Get three and out. Get the ball back. It just keeps going. We got a decent squad on defense. A lot of young guys too. But we'll take that math this sack. Nice first play of the or second play, I should say. So third and eighteen. We want to get the ball back. We like our odds here. But Shane Bichel says not nah, not gonna happen. Wide open Tyler Page down the middle of the field. So two plays later we got him at second and goal. Our rezo defense is pretty solid, I say myself. I think we can get these guys. Mmm, uh, nah, because Shane Bichel says seven yards. I'm taking it. Seven, seven. Let's go. He wants the iron skill. He wants to keep it. He didn't like us when he was with Texas, and he doesn't like us now when he's at SMU. It's a third and eight. Who do we go to? Clinton Jones. Yes, sir. That dude is going to be automatic. Couple plays later, second and three. Who other than Mad Max Duggan? Another nine yard rush. They can't stop me. This might be doing this. We're going to be doing this all day, guys. They're going to roll out, just like always. Gets down to the one, but can't quite score. 11 yards. Mad Max Duggan. So, obviously, obviously, we punch it in. Their next drive, we hold them to three boring plays, and we get a punt. But Darius Davis doesn't want to turn on them yet. Doesn't want to show them the speed. He says, say that for So, first and ten. Might as well throw it up because this dude's having a good game. But we can't get nothing there. But there's a flag and we'll most likely be on defense. Which is rare because I never get those calls in this game. But we'll take it. A couple plays later. Who other than Mad Max trying to get a big run and keep this drive going. We'll take that 13 yards any day. Another re-option play. They can't stop. They don't know who to go. They don't know to follow. Barlow, Evans, Duggan. Because his defense on ice, guys. Or I should say skates. <laughs> Easy 35. But he's stuffed at the one. 12 seconds left in the quarter. They get ball at half. We punch it in. Kick a field goal. Coach calls a timeout. And he says, let's get six. <clears throat> We've been doing this play 
the majority of the game has been working, getting like three yards every time probably. So why not? But their defense says nope, no yards, turnover, ending the half, no score. Hopefully that doesn't bite us later, not going for the field goal. So, they get ball, their first drive. He has all day to throw the ball. He can just sit there and choose who wants to. Exactly what he did. Granson wide open. Coverage wasn't there. He got past their corners and safeties were slacking. And now he says, get off me, Wallow. With a big run, but Washington comes in safe. James Michelle, man. He's out to get us. Does not like us. Third and three. Running again. Slides at the one yard line. Don't know why, but he could have just scored. A couple plays later, we get him at third and goal. Hoping to hold him to a field goal. And that's not the case here. Shane Michelle says, Max Duggan can do it. I can do it. Let me tie this thing up right here. But we're not worried. It's 14 14. We're good. First and 10. Our next drive. We're sure. They go, but they can't guard everybody. Quentin Johnson hitting the burners on them. This kid is fast. He can run. He can catch. He can probably throw it. Second and 10. What are we going to do? Roll out. My boy wide open, but he drops it in what is a dagger to this drive. Interception. Look at this wide open. He could just score. He in the end zone celebrating right now. High fiving the team. I thought about challenging it, but I was like, wait. We're good. We're good. So, their next drive. What are we going to do? Nothing. Because he can't make the tackle. Gets a good block. And this dude is running like Lamar Jackson. Michael Vick with number seven on him. He's running with a purpose. 80 something yards. This is not looking too good right now. Luckily, there's a lot of time left. My defense is shook that this dude's killing us with his legs this time, not his arm. That's, uh, it's not good. He makes some adjustments before this game ends because he's, uh, having a day. <clears throat> but we're still chilling. We're going down seven. Still got time in the third. Whole fourth quarter left. Max isn't worried. He's not a freshman no more. He knows what to do. We're going to do what we keep doing. Mad, Mad Max says, I want to get a big goal. Not 80 yards, but we'll take 15 from the 15. This guy can do it all. Like I got to say, every time. Wide open, pull wells down the middle. Can't forget to guard him. He's a big dude, but they did. We get a 30 yard reception. And he says, I want the ball. So he tackles Max Duggan so he can throw the ball to him next time. That would have been the house call. I'm calling it. He would have been the house. 30-16. We need something big. So what do we do? Deep ball to Quentin Johnson, folks. If you watch this game in real life, you know that's really serious. These two this season connected so many times in the game. So their next drive. Second and six. We cannot stop this man. Darius Washington tries to make the tackle. Shane Buchel says, get off me. I'm taking this to the house. But tackle at the two-yard line. Shane Buchel, folks, getting faster as the game gets longer. And Darius Washington bounces off him. Can't make the tackle. Shane Buchel says, get yeah, by man. man, this dude is killing our defense. Fourth quarter, four minutes into, or four minutes left, I should say. We got to get down and score. Nice quick packs to Tay Barber. We got to run some hurry up, folks. But, at the same time, our defense, there's no defense in this game, as you can see. Like, I don't know. Whoever gets the ball last is probably going to win this game. Breaks one tackle. Down to the 10. 4 17. Next play. Who keeps it? The real QB in this game, Matt Max. That's just my biased opinion, obviously. Chambu show is cold. But we don't like him today. Not at all. And look at this guy. Just running a game. Easy 13 yards. They ran a lot of hurry up this game, so that's one reason why my defense probably gave up some of those plays. They're just gassed. Tired. I don't want to waste all my timeouts. But we're not falling for this run this time. Finally get him to a negative three yard run. Jane Buchel finally gets stopped. Second and in inches. Woo. Just nothing you can do about that, guys. Good coverage, just a better catch. And good throw. So a couple plays later, we got first and goal. 
down at the two yard line. He could have almost scored here to the outside, but there's still hope for our defense. We're in the hurry up, like I said, in the all out blitz because you know they're going to run the ball. And boom, exactly what happens. Meets the wall. Third and goal. We're looking up. Two minutes left. We need one stop. Pull into a field goal. That field goal decision might be haunting me, folks. Because look at the score. Tie game still. And no good angle on Mulrick. It's just an uh, easy touchdown. We, we slacked. I made him look bad. Mm -hmm. 35, 28, 1 minute and 48 seconds left. But we have two timeouts. We're not ready. Tommy Lynch is like, dang, we're a crazy first game coach. Max W, folks, second and eight. Can he lead us to a game? Well, game time, I should say. Tight window, Quinn Johnson. I thought that was going to be picked. I was like, nope, this is game. We just lost. But I doubt my own players. Look at me. Big run. That was easy 12 yards. 53 seconds. And you can see Max is gas, so we just waste the time out. You know, we got to get my boys fresh. We can't afford any uh, hiccups out here. First and ten. Right in the corner, Darius Washington. Just wide open, but look how much time is left. 30 seconds. Well, 29 seconds to be exact. Darius Washington. Fast kid. Good hands. Another weapon on our offense. So, I, as you can see, that just showed the score, the plays. It's been a shootout. No defense. Look at Shane Michel. Garrett Wall's not having it. He's tired of him. Gets a stop. Let's go. Second and ten. We're not trying to give him full range. We want this game to go OT. But Garrett Wallace, folks, comes in with a clutch senior linebacker. He's tired of this dude. I can't even speak because I'm so excited. Killing us this game. So all we got to do is kick a field goal and this game is over. Or we can get a house call with Max Duggan. All the way to the ten. All the way down to the three. But the next play, we just line it up, and then leads to this. They try to ice us. No way he misses this, right? Right. Because that's game, folks. Crazy first game. Only game one in the season in our defense and offense. It's just, everything was crazy. I, I don't know. I can't talk crap about this defense. <laughs> We're all right, folks. 35-38. Game one. Let's celebrate, get the iron skillet, and get ready for Boise State next week. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, whatever, you know. And just stay tuned for next week. Thanks. Peace out. Go Frogs, baby.